I am a singer, a Broadway performer, an activist, truth slayer, and a keeper of black girl magic. Oh yeah, some feathers gonna be ruffled because that's how I roll. I just wanted to join social media like everybody else so that uh, the people who followed my music could keep up with me. And then Trayvon Martin happened. Every other singer and artist was still posting selfies. I mean, since I've been talking about uh, socio-political issues, my followers have gone up. What I didn't expect, what has caught me completely by surprise is the amount of followers who engage on my social media and not because of music. I am a member of the LGBT community and I am also a black woman. If we only care about civil rights when it pertains to gay people being able to get married and then we're silent when unarmed black men are being killed, I'm not okay with that. I didn't realize how much of an impact these conversations were having on the amount of traffic my social media pages received until I posted a video of one of my performances and one of my followers said, wow, I had no idea you could sing like that. I started following you because of one of your Black Lives Matter rants. And that was kind of an aha moment in which I realized, wow, um, people are really paying attention to my voice and not my singing voice. I got the idea for Purses of Hope uh, from one of my followers. She took a purse that she wasn't using anymore and she decided to stuff it with you know, a toothbrush, toothpaste, tampons, basically personal care items, and she gave it to the homeless woman on her corner. You can go to the dollar store, buy a toothbrush, and give it to the homeless woman on the corner and bless her life that day. Then I partnered up uh, with the new women's homeless shelter that they built on Skid Row here in Los Angeles. Things like tampons and toothpaste, like those are things that I couldn't imagine living without if I didn't have anywhere to live. Because I've chosen to live my life in a certain kind of truth, I may have ruffled too many feathers. Missing out on singing opportunities because I lived my life in truth, that I can live with.